I'm working on firewood today and I go to uncover some and I found this nice sized garter snake. Now some people mistakenly refer to them as garden snakes, G-A-R-D-E-N. They're not, they are garter, G-A-R-T-E-R. So called because they resembled the garters that they used to used to hold up stockings. Uh, garter snakes are interesting. They eat all kinds of things. They'll eat earthworms, they'll eat toads, they'll eat frogs, they'll eat fish, they'll eat rodents. So it's not something you really want to kill if you have a problem with mice or rats. I uh, wouldn't mind taking this guy out to the farm, but I don't think he'd stay. I don't know if this is a male or a female. Uh, from what I've read, female snakes tend to be a little bit larger than male. And can't really say how long this guy is. I'm not going to handle it. I don't want to disturb it it's more than I have to. And depending on where they are, garter snakes can be active year-round. And those areas where they're not, from what I've read, they can nest, many of them together, in a common area during the colder months. I don't believe they actually go into a regular hibernation. I've heard that they on warmer days in the winter you can even sometimes find them outside and unlike a lot of other snakes garter snakes give birth to live up to 50 so this guy looks like it's getting ready to leave I hope so because I need to get all this wood out from underneath the here to sort it out and another reason I don't want to handle it is they will, if you handle them, they put out a foul smell, which doesn't really smell too good on your hands. And since I don't want that, another reason I don't want to handle it, it's going through a hole in the tarp. May or may not see it again while I work some more on this wood. Have a nice day.